Hello my friends and welcome to the video. So I want to wish everybody a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year depending on when you guys are watching this. So today is a very special day. Why? Well, I mean we're starting it off with donuts so what's more special than that? So we did go to the one and only 5 Donuts and we have a pretty amazing selection here. Let me see if I can show you guys without dropping it. So look at that. So we have a few festive holiday donuts and then also we do have the legendary Krona. Now I have not had the Krona in, it's been quite some time. So let me show you guys that baby right now. Oh yeah, look at that. All right, without further ado, let's just get started. So the first bite of the day. So sweet and so perfect. Hmm. And we do have a hot chocolate from Dunkin' Donuts. Now, I, I can't remember the last time I had hot chocolate. It's been kind of cold down here in Florida. Like, the mornings have been like 55, 56. I know that that's not like extremely cold compared to like Massachusetts where I'm from, but when you're used to like 75 to 80 degree weather, 55 feels pretty cold, so. Mm. Ooh, that hot chocolate's good. All right, moving right down the line. This next donut, let me just, uh, yeah, we'll, 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 we'll do the Plant City first. And then the rest are gonna be holiday specials. So you guys have seen the Plant City before. Y'all know what it is. Strawberries, whipped cream, strawberry frosting. Yeah, this thing is fire. Cheers. Sorry, I'll keep my face clean. <laughs> Uh, the thing is everything. So simple, but so amazing. Man, I dig this combo. Hot chocolate and donuts. That's a first for me. And Usually I always get like coffee or something, but man, that hot chocolate is just mood the bomb. <laughs> so next up, we are gonna go with the white trash. Now I've had this donut before, and I think it's been about a year since I had it. I did have it on the last Christmas cheat day, so basically one year ago. So check this baby out. We do have pretzels, we have M&Ms, we have checks, we have vanilla frosting. And then in the middle, I forget what it is. It, it, it's almost like a, almost like a, a cream cheese type frosting in the middle. There's also peanuts in there too. So, all right, guys, here we have it: the white trash. Ooh, look at that! It kind of tastes like cookie dough. Like a vanilla cookie dough. Oh, and last cheat day, I apologize again because there was no audio on the camera. And so I did just kind of do like a little like montage of me eating the donuts. And a lot of you guys did miss the part of me talking and explaining the donuts. I know some people don't like donuts and they fast forward through it, but... I mean, it is what it is. I love donuts and I will always, I mean, typically start my cheat days with donuts. But yeah, to all y'all who love donuts, much love because I love them too. All right, next up, we're gonna go for now check this one out. 
So you guys know how much I love the Cookie Monster. This one right here is the white Cookie Monster. So we do have, I believe, buttercream frosting. I think that is like sugar cookie crumbles on top. We do have some cookie butter as well as some Christmas sprinkles. So here we go, guys. The white Cookie Monster. Oh, that is phenomenal. I don't know, I might like this one better than the OG Cookie Monster. Hmm. All right, and now moving on to the last and final donut. Yo, this thing is a tank. This thing is seriously so heavy. <laughs> so check it out. It is, um, I believe these these ones that they call Long Johns at 5.0. So it's like the just basically a long donut. So inside it is filled. And I believe she did say it was peppermint filled. And we do have like a entire like Christmas tree thing on top. So I don't even know how I'm going to bite this thing but I think we got it all right here we go wow oh yeah it does have a really nice peppermint pop It kind of tastes like a peppermint patty with stuff on the inside and there's like little chunks of like chocolate peppermint. Yeah, this was a really big donut. Ooh, all right. Well, that is the start of today's cheat day. And man, hot chocolate and donuts, amazing combination. So I haven't really done a cheat day lately where I added up all the calories, but since you guys have been pretty nice, I will tally up the calories for all these donuts and today's cheat day. So that is the very start, and I'll see you guys very shortly. After you. Come on, Zoe. Come on. Come on. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. You can do it. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. You can do it. Come on. Come on. That a girl. Yeah. Yes, she is. Yes, she is. All right, my friends, so we are here at Sonic. Now, I've only been to Sonic one time, and if you guys know me, I always get the same thing, so this time I'm going to order stuff that I've never had before. I really did want to get that bacon double cheeseburger again, but I'm gonna try this sandwich. It's called the Bacon Cheeseburger Toaster. So it does have like an onion ring on it. It's got some barbecue sauce on some Texas toast. Also, we're going to go with some boneless wings. We are going to try out the breakfast burrito and we are going to get a Snickers Blizzard. Let's place the order. There. How's it going? Good. Here's that. Thank you. There you are. There you go. 
I got a straw and a spoon right here. And did you want your receipt at all? Uh, no, thank you. Awesome. Well, you have a great day, okay? Thank you, you too. Here you go. Oh, thank you so much. You're Come welcome. On, thank you. Have Merry a great Christmas. Day. All right, all right. We uh, we got the food here. Zoe's already trying to climb over here, snooping around. But this isn't for you. But I got some snacks for you, so I'll keep you occupied. All right, I'm going to switch angles right now. Okay, so we did get everything that I did say that I was going to get, as well as some tater tots. So I ended up getting the meal with the bacon cheeseburger toaster. So it did come with tater tots. And again, these are all items that I have never had from Sonic. So it does smell pretty dang good. And I think I'm gonna start with the breakfast burrito first because, I don't know, isn't that how it's supposed to go? Start with breakfast and then you go on. So yeah, we're gonna start with the breakfast burrito first. All right, check it out. We got some egg hanging out there. So let's see what it's all about. Mmm. Oh, there's all kinds of goodness in here. So I believe there is eggs, cheese, tater tots, sausage, peppers, onions, jalapeno. Yeah, that's pretty tasty. Oh, we do have some uh, salsa sonic sauce. Let's throw it on here. If you guys know me, you know I love spice. So much better with the sauce. Alright, now let's move on to the wings. And Zoe is like respectfully just sitting there watching me eat. She's not like trying to climb up over here and get my food. So thank you for that, babe. Next, we're going to try out some of these wings. So these are the honey barbecue. Check these things out. Let's give them a try. Okay. Bone swings are good, but I really do like a buffalo wing like I got from that Michelangelo's restaurant. Those things were phenomenal. But these are pretty good. Last wing. Yeah, it's getting hot in here. This suit is crazy hot. Oh, I'm gonna eat the rest of this meal without the hat on because it's just too hot. And now moving on to the bacon cheeseburger toaster. This thing looks pretty damn tasty. So check it out, there's Texas toast, there's lettuce, there's tomato, there's cheese, there's a burger patty, there's an onion ring, and then also I believe there is barbecue sauce as well. So, all right. And there's also pickles on there for my bro Nate Figs. <laughs> all right, cheers my friends. I don't know what it is, but it tastes different. I can't figure it out. I don't know, maybe it's a, the Texas toast. I don't know if it's like a, I don't know, it, it tastes very different than a regular burger. I don't know why, maybe it's because I had those honey barbecue wings, but. Or maybe it's the bread. I think it might be the Texas toast. Mm. I wish you guys could see Zoe sleeping right now. She's so adorable. I'm gonna take a picture with my phone and I'll put it on the screen. Just look at that. I love that dog. All 
Oh yeah, so that sandwich was definitely different. Um, I can't really pinpoint why it was different, but something to me, I don't know, it was just different. But now let's try out some of these tater tots. Again, I've never had these from Sonic. Ooh, those are good. I should have got ketchup though. I, th I just thought maybe they would just bring it. But, yeah, we're gonna have to eat these without ketchup. These are tasty. I'll give them that. But, if I did have some ketchup, they'd go up a point in my book. All right, and now time for dessert. We do have the Sonic Blast. This is the Snickers flavor. It is a size medium. Let's give it a try. Now, last time I was here, I believe I did have the Reese's one. So, let's give it a try. Yeah, so it does have chunks of Snickers in there and like a vanilla ice cream. Very nice. All right, well, it's gonna take me a while to eat this thing. So uh, I'm gonna fast forward so you guys don't get bored. Did you have a good nap? Yeah? You get some good sleep? Yes, you did. Yes, you did. All right guys, and we are back and we have some food in front of us. So we did stop at McDonald's. We got a Big Mac, we got a large fry, we got a Coca-Cola. And right here, this is Ample Farms ice cream. So this was sent to me by Adam Waddington and he sent me like a four pack and he said this is seriously his favorite ice cream. It's the best ice cream on the planet. So I cannot wait to try it out. It is called Snap Milo Pop and it's a deconstructed Rice Krispie Treat marshmallow ice cream mixed with baked and buttery Rice Krispie clusters. That sounds crazy. And then over here, this is a package and it is from Rachel Bowman. So we're gonna get to that very shortly. First off, let's dive into this Mickey D's. I don't know, I was just kind of craving a Big Mac. Kind of to redeem myself from that Terrible Sonic um, burger, Texas toast sandwich. It was okay, but I just couldn't figure out what was wrong with it. It just had a very strange taste. All right, so we got classic McDonald's and we get the Big Mac. Here we go. Let me see how many bites I can eat this in. <laughs> All right, how, how, how many, comment down below how many bites you think it'll take me to finish a Big Mac. All right, here we go. Oh yeah. That Mac sauce, baby. No, it's too good. Uh, all right, well, a Big Mac and two bites. <laughs> Let's move on to some of these fries. I, mean, I ate a bunch of the fries on the way home. They were nice and salty. They're just a classic.
Zoe wants to get up here so bad right now. <laughs> what? What do you want? What do you want? Okay, there you go. You're the star of the show. Come on. You're on the air. Don't blow it. This is your only chance. Come on. She just smells french fries on my fingers. <laughs> okay. You blew it. I'll give you another try in like 20 minutes. All right, next, let's move on to, I'm gonna let this ice cream kind of thaw a little bit. So we will open up this package. It is from Minnesota, Maplewood, Minnesota. And uh, I'd say it's pretty cold over there right now. All right, here we go. Yo. <laughs> no way. Yo, guys, look at this. For the beautiful Indy, never too young for big bites. Oh my God, this is amazing. So if you guys don't know who Indy is, Indy is my niece and she is about five months old now. And yeah, she is just amazing. So this, I, I, I still, I can't believe that she sent this. This is amazing. Thank you so much. Wow, that is just way too cool. Oh, and my favorite. You guys already know, Stroop Waffles. I'm gonna just dump this out. Ooh, we got some protein cake bites, chocolate frosted donut flavor. We have a Quest Hero protein bar. This is the blueberry cobbler flavor. Over here is Brock's Donut Candy Corn. Look at that, wow. You know me too well. I've actually never had this candy corn, so I'm, I'm very interested to see how it tastes. We have another bag of the Brock's Candy Corn. Uh, this, pop, no way, she got stuff for Zoe. Paw print keepsake, wow. Look at that. So I guess it's gonna be her paw prints as like a Christmas ornament. That is that is too cool. Um, <laughs> check it out, we got a donut floaty. Go swimming in the pool with this. Um, we got another Quest protein box. Chocolate sprinkled donut. Uh, this one is a Zone macros bar. Yeah, we got three musketeers. Oh, this is the birthday cake flavor. Birthday cake, three musketeers. Now this is like my favorite candy bar. I've actually only had the birthday cake, three musketeers once. I got it once from Walmart and then I just never ever seen it again. So I'm super stoked to have some more of these. We have a one protein bar, maple glazed donut. Uh, we get some more Stroop waffles, chocolate caramel. Uh, oh, Met Rex Bar, Jelly Donut Crunch. Check that out. I don't know where she found all these because I've never seen any of these before. A Berries and Cream Think Bar. And we have some Jelly Beans. Krispy Kreme Donut Flavored. Oh, and also, this is <laughs> Zoe's Christmas Treat to Eat with Rudolph. Look at that. Oops. And then... Here's our little treat. Wow, that is just too damn cool. Seriously, thank you so much. Oh, I didn't even read the letter. I got too excited for everything. Hold on, we gotta read the letter. I usually read the letter first and then I open everything up, but I just get too excited. Okay. There are absolutely no words that are able to describe the immense amount of gratefulness that I have for you. Each day you create smiles of joy across my face. Each day you radiate inspiration upon me. Each day instill endless hope into my heart. Each moment you walk with me on my journey towards life. Simply put, you are a gift to me. You are my blessing, you are my angel. For 21 years of my life, I have been barely surviving. I've been living in hospitals and cheating death. I have been non-existent, a stolen identity, a lost spirit. For 21 years of my life, I was fully consumed by an eating disorder. Each moment I was held captive by torturous screams of the eating disorder. You are too fat to live. You will never be loved weighing this number. The world would be better without your fat body in it. About six years ago, I finally broke free from the deadly grasp of eating disorder. I finally became strong enough to begin the battle of the eating disorder. 
I slowly began to discover the authentic, true Rachel, not the eating disorder, and make the whole heart commitment to choose life. I fully trusted that God is longing for me to live an abundant, full life, and I was strong enough to act in that trust. Each day is still a fierce battle between the eating disorder and the authentic, true Rachel, but now I am able to choose life more and more. Each of my small victories lead me steps closer on my journey towards my abundant, full life. You, Nick, are with me with each moment of choosing life. You have overtaken a special place within my heart. You have been with me through all my tears and all my pain, all of my loneliness, all of my knocks at death's door. With your pure love of life and fierce burning passion to live each moment to its greatest potential, you have been a consistent motivation and inspiration of what life can be. Thank you for giving me life. Thank you for giving me life. Thank you for being my angel. Team Big Bites forever, Rachel Bowman. Wow, seriously, I just wanna say, you are very welcome and you know I do get messages daily you know regarding like you know people saying how I've helped them and I mean yes my videos are helping a lot of people but this really just like hit home and it was like wow it, it is really having a lot of impact on a lot of people so I just want to say I'm super happy for you and to keep on moving forward and life is amazing as long as you allow it to be so keep up the good work and yeah seriously thank you so much for all this stuff and oh, there's, a, there's another card over here. I don't know what I would do without you. <laughs> you are what you eat. So this is some um, photos from Rachel. So seriously, again, thank you so much, Rachel. Now it is time to dive in. So I think, uh, what are we gonna try here? We gotta go for the Stroop Waffle first because I absolutely love these things. Ooh, there's actually two in here, so I'm just gonna eat it as like a, a stroop waffle sandwich. Mmm. These things are amazing. Soft toasted waffles filled with caramel, cinnamon, and real bourbon vanilla. Wow, I'm sweating. Right. I'm gonna take the half because. I'm on fire right now. <laughs> Ooh. The combination of a lot of carbohydrates and a Santa soup do not go well together. Those scoop waffles are fire. All right, next I want to dig into this thing right here. Think thin, high protein bar, berries, and cream. You guys know how I feel about fruit. So let's give it a try. Ooh, it smells, it smells like fruit snacks. It kind of reminds me of those Nutri-Grain bars, like the raspberry Nutri-Grain bars. Very good. So next, let's dive into, all right, got a Jelly Donut Met Rest bar. Now, I've had these bars before, but I've never had the Jelly Donut one. And you guys know how I feel about donuts, so. Pretty big bar. Mm. It kind of tastes like a jelly Rice Krispie treat, but with like a hint of like graham cracker. All right, and now let's dive into the Three Musketeers birthday cake. All right, so we got some miniatures over here. Check it out. Oh yeah. 
I love that mousse inside of the three mustard tears. Hmm. But I think I want to dive into some of that ice cream now. All right. So snap, Milo, pop. Let's give this stuff a try. Wow. You weren't kidding, bro. How do they do that? It seriously tastes like a Rice Krispie Treat, but like a cold, milky Rice Krispie Treat. That is crazy, bro. Thank you, Adam. Wait about, I'd say about half, and um, yeah, I'm pretty good with food for the day. All right, my friends, and that is going to be today's video. I hope you guys did enjoy it. I want to give a big thank you to Adam, and also a huge thank you to Rachel. Seriously. That was probably the best Christmas present that I could ever get. That letter, seriously, means a lot to me. I really appreciate it, and I'm so thankful that my videos have had an impact on your life. So keep on moving forward. Stay strong. You got this. But yeah, that's going to be today's video. I want to thank Zoe for joining me today as well. It was a pretty fun day. Always a good time. And yeah, that's going to be our Christmas cheat day. So I want to wish everybody a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. And yeah, just keep on keeping on. So much love, guys. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video.